Okay, we have one more set of theorems we're going to deal with here, and that is the HL theorem for triangle congruence. HL stands for hypotenuse, which is always a fun one to spell. H-Y-P-O-T-E-N-E-U-S-E. -E -E. Hypotenuse leg theorem of congruence. And that means that if we know the long side of a triangle, which is the hypotenuse, so we'll say from here down to here. If we know the hypotenuse of a triangle, and we know either one of the two legs, so either this one or this one, and we know that the triangle is a right triangle, then we can prove that it's congruent with another one just by knowing the same information. So if the other triangle has the same hypotenuse and leg, whichever, hypot whichever leg we choose, so the hypotenuse and whichever leg we decide to choose are the same, and it's also a right triangle, then we know that the two triangles are congruent. But it is very important that you note that this only works for right triangles. With a right triangle, you only need to know the hypotenuse on one side, and then you'll know that the two triangles are congruent. So that's a pretty straightforward uh, uh, sort of a policy there. We use that with the other lessons with the uh, angle side angle and uh, side angle side going to be very similar except in this case because we're using the right angle we don't have to worry about the other angles that's the one we're going to use as our angle and it's already there if it's a right triangle so just look for the hypotenuse and one of the other two sides let's take a look at how that applies to our uh, example problems mm -hmm.